Hi, this is Mato. In this video, I will show a very beautiful chess game. This is the game between Daly and Mangarini. It was played in Boston in 1937. Boston is a city in the United States. Game started with f4, d5, and after e3 and the knight to f6, we have Bert's opening. Knight to f3, g6, black wants to Fianchetto his bishop to g7, b3, bishop to g7, bishop to b2, knight from b to d7, c4 attacking black pawn on d5, e6, queen to c2, more protection, to bishop on b2, c5, knight to c3, black castled, and it is white to move, and in this position he made an interesting plan. He wants to push his h pawn as far as it can go. So he started with h4. Black captured on c4, and this is not exactly the best move. It's helping white to develop his bishop, and the bishop is now in good spot. Queen to e7. And how should white continue? If he pushes pawn to h5, then knight will take. But white pushed his pawn anyway. Black captured with knight on h5. And what now? White sacrificed the exchange. Pawn takes a rook. And it is white to move. What would you play in this position if you had white pieces? It's not a killer move. It is nice attacking move. And look at this knight looking into this very juicy square from where he can attack black king and this is the move that white played knight to g5 and threat is queen takes on h7 check mate black played a knight to f6 what would happen if black played f5 to prevent that then bishop takes on e6 we check king to h8 and knight to d5 and white would have winning attack in the game black played knight to f6 and it is white to move and white played a killer move in this position if you wish you can pause this video and you can try to find that killer move yourself Unless white finds that killer move, then black would be better. Okay, so black is better in all variation except this one. What is the move? White has put all his money on the white horse. Knight to d5. If knight takes on d5, then queen takes on h7 checkmate so black captured with pawn but after white captured knight on f6 black resigned because if queen takes then queen takes on h7 checkmate okay let's go through some very interesting points of the game in this position that was very good start of white's attack and then again in this position white played that brilliant move that ended the game shortly afterwards very nice attack isn't it and that is all i hope that you enjoyed watching this video i wish you good luck with your chess and bye for now